This video is going to be a tutorial on how to properly ID a sheep on our 4-H online animal ID. This is for the year 2020. So first I am going to show you the tags that we are using as our examples today. So here is our 4-H tag right here that we got from the extension office. Here is an example of our scrapies tag. And then here is an example of a photo that we will need to upload. This is new for the 2020 year. Instead of retinal imaging, uh, all sheep will have to upload three pictures, this being an example of one of those pictures. That is for county and state fair lambs. So we are going to log into our 4-H online website. Go to your 4-honline.com, select Iowa, and this is the page that will come up. Enter your email and your password, and your role will be family. Here's our home page. Yours might look a little bit differently, but we will continue to family. Next page has our family information, including the members in our family. So you will want to go to the youth that you are entering this sheep for. The youth that you are entering must have an enrollment status of active. If it says pending or inactive, you will need to contact the extension office to figure out how you can get that change to active. I am using a demo account in order to make this video, so it will allow me to do animal ID on a pending status. So we will go to edit. This first page will be our personal information about ourselves, our school, um, allergies we may have. So we will Go up here to the top, that one was enrollment, we want to go to this animals livestock tab. And my youth has no animals that have been ID'd yet. So we will go to add an animal, choose our animal type, we are doing sheep, add animal. This top part is information you will want to read over. It has a lot of information of what all is needed, especially for 2020, without having the retinal imaging information about the photos that are required for this year. So we are going to need our tag, which side, which ear the tag is in. For our use, we will need our scrapey flock ID. Need the birth date, what breed our animal is, and then the sex. And then we'll put home raised if it is home raised or not for our county fair. And then here are where we would upload our pictures. So let's start in the beginning. Let's put our tag number in. So we'll go back to our picture of our tag that we are using as an example. So we're not going to enter the 4-2. We're going to start with the letters. So JJT. Eight, three, seven, one. And then the side ear we're on. So we are going to use that picture as our example upload. And I have blocked out that number that was on the tag just to make it so it wasn't confusing when I was using it as an example. But for our example, we will pretend that it says JJT8371, and this is in our left ear. So we don't have to change that. Scrapey flock ID. This one, yours may look differently. Our birth date get your records to write that one in. Ours is a special baby. 
You will enter what breed you're doing. Ours is going to be crossbred and it's going to be female. So we have this top part done. If it's home raised, please enter home raised. Next will be the upload of the pictures. I do not have an example of left side view and right side view, but those will be required for county and state fair, so make sure that you actually enter those in. Your tag photo, we will do that one. So we went to select, and then you go to wherever you have your picture saved. Here's where my picture is. I press open. It popped up. It shows that it's there. So we're all good. The only thing is that I would have to come back later and enter in my left and my right side view of my lamb. Press save. And you'll definitely have to be careful because it does say active even though I did not complete all of the photos. So make sure you're double and triple checking that you have that complete. You can always call the extension office to make sure that you have everything finished. That is a very good option to take advantage of. With that, we are finished with our sheep example for Iowa 4-H Online Animal ID.